And speaking of, um, honorable mentions. Sheffy, or sh- uh, I guess this might be spelled Sheffy as well. Right? Is it Sheffy? What is it? Um, C-H-I-E-F-Y. So different than um, Sheffy, it's the other I-E. Sheffy. This is what a Y. All right. Um, green light. Supreme Swiss. Uber Black. Bang, set the deposit and deliver. Lord forgive me, I don't think I can forgive her. So salty, ironically, they bitter. Supreme Swiss is a uh, alumni, no? Yes, yes, yes. Big fucking two and two. Um, one up and Cole Bands, Perk Water, QP. What we played at the top of the show. Oh, is she lonely. technically an alumni? Uh, not yet, because she wasn't on camera. Okay. Um, take this from me. Yes, sir. Yes. Uh, goods and YTG foreign. K Goon, a uh, couple G's. Representing Montreal. Um, Banana Clips, aka DXM or RM, Insomnia, Marvin against me. You never seem to admit when you're on. MG Baby, Money. Keish, um, Drake War Freestyle. All this pain that I feel inside. Do I let it show? Do I let it hide? What a family this? Do I let it slide? Do I suck it up? Do I let it die? Um, Dre Day, Astronaut. Wait a second here. Uh, P Mills, Coma Freestyle. First place, Furby Helen. Can I get top line? Need me to relish. Ain't no talking, but we spitting your melon. Mr. Wild, they gon' keep the weapon. Where I'm from, I'm gonna need the protection. I forgot oh. when Elsie walk up, no? Oh, Elsie walk up. Um, big fucking tune. Um, oh, Derek, meet me in uh, Toronto f- uh, featuring Keish, who was also on that uh, war freestyle. Let them stop you. I'm allergic to the bullshit like you. I chew, I chew, baby. Hit, 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 hit him with the reverse. He plays f- and YN grind. Sing. Yo, this, yo, listen to me. The honorable mentions and the six, the six list or the list of six songs, the top six lists, whatever. The entire list. The yeah, entire yeah. list, and to- including the six that mm-hmm. are on top, mm-hmm. is always impressive every yeah. week. And then, like, yo, the music, the amount of music that's coming out. Big ups to you guys. Keep pushing the music. Mm-hmm. You guys are actually giving us something to do, something to talk about. Facts, right? So, and thank the, you guys. And and, and there's always at least. 15 to 20 tracks to go through at least proud of you keep busy that's what it is keep busy what do they say idle hands is the the hands of the devil yeah Mm -hmm. or idle mind is the devil's playground whatever Mm -hmm. you know what I mean so keep yourself busy yeah man um let's get to some uh some more ads because I guess we blessed today oh Jesus Christ all types of good 420 stuff so big shouts to uh, MED, Mother Earth Deliveries. They, they blessed us with a bag of this Skywalker pink right here. Did someone say something about empty pipes? Jeez, mm, didn't hear that one. <laughs> <laughs> Them type of shots? You know, I had to, had to deep, dig deep. It's been a minute. You know what I'm saying? It's been a while. So this right here, um, they're still doing 25% off the first order um, when, you, when you do a delivery with them. You know what I'm saying? And if you use our code, you get $5 off the delivery. Yeah, man, that's, a, that's a hot code right there. Yo, or, stack. Yeah, or not $5 off the oh, delivery. Um, the delivery fee. Free sorry. delivery. Free delivery. delivery. Sorry, I was fun. like, wait. Yeah. Sorry, my <laughs> bad. Free delivery. My bad. I apologize. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, we stack. The, and you can stack the code as a first-time user. Fam. We got, the, we got the goods over here, yo. You know what I'm saying? Mm, hard um, to hit them up at least one time. Yeah. And at they, least one time. <laughs> I ain't even gonna lie. I'm, they got me. They got me hooked. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but um, hit them up on their website, meddispensary.ca, um, or on Instagram, Mother Earth underscore to. And like we said, they got that fire. Facts. Um, now those tracks. Okay. Okay. There was a lot of tracks. We're talking about the freestyles. Yes. The war, war freestyles. freestyles. Okay. Now, a lot of war freestyles... Let's be freestyles, specific so yes. that people know what we're talking about when you say, oh, the, the tracks. Thank you, thank you, yeah. Because, you know, I'm just like, I'm so excited to get put into this. Your, put your... Just this joker green you have here, yeah. just relax, man. <laughs> why are you so relax. serious, right? I'll tell you why I'm so serious. <laughs> okay. Just calm down. Because I did the radio show the other day, right? We love hip-hop radio. Look out for that, all right? I just want to say this for my city in regards to the song War. My goal was always to uplift and show love to the rappers 
that are buzzing and gaining the world's attention. My goal is to... It's up on the Facebook as well. You know what I'm saying? I, I repost the episodes on Facebook. Apparently, they're just letting it fly with all the tunes playing. All right? We but, will see. We'll see. Mm-hmm. Was talking about um, Drizzy Drake. Mm-hmm. Okay. He put up a like a whole long a soliloquy, statement. a statement, IG you post. You called it a soliloquy like he performed it live. <laughs> but go on. <laughs> Friday, this one is sound important right now. Okay. Now, you, did you see this post? I read it. You read we, the post. Do we I all need read to the post. read the statement again? No, no, we're not going to read that. Okay, good. Okay. He, uh, prime, I read, you sent the Prime one too. Prime made a statement too, right? Yeah, Prime pre mm. made pre- a statement too, yeah, right? Pre- um, sorry. Formerly known as Pre-Rain. Yes. Now, here's the thing. I want to ask you, because I asked the comment gang, comment gang, scrown, why they felt that this came out. Because the last time the man made any type of, like, you know, I got to read a statement to the public is when Pusha T pulled out the, the blackface pick. And, now, and he was like, I got to address this. Like, fuck the staying silent shit. I got to make a statement. But now, tune drop and man makes a statement. Why do you guys think that? I think it's just based off of the title of the track. Mm. Right? And the way the city is hot right now doesn't really help. This is the true. climate. The climax. Yeah, or yeah. climate. The climate. Sorry. Mm. The climate here. Right? Is... You're talking war, you know. You're talking about oh, you used to look up to an next man till he turn, and you know. So, I don't think those are the bars that hold, got him in. No, the hold on, let me finish. Mm. So I'm just saying those are whatever. I'm not saying those are the bars. I'm just saying with those bars like that and other type of bars throughout the track, and the name is 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 war. People are thinking, you know what? So this is the suit to it's follow. A, it's a war thing. So it's a war thing. All right, mm. I'll show you a war thing. And people are talking their war talks or whatever, or they're not even talking their war talking. They're just going over the beat because that's the song that's popping right now. Yeah, yeah. Right? And people, some people say, oh, this Drake sounds the most like Toronto on this track than any of his other tracks. Yeah, and then the people in the states, like, shout right. out to the, our American audience, big up to y'all. But he's not sounding like a UK man's. He sounds like a Toronto man's. Okay. That's what people in the States don't understand, but you guys should understand, you guys should know, especially like the fact that the amount of Jamaicans in the States. That too. Ooh, like, Drake Marley. But it's not even about that. It's like, yo, Jamaicans, <laughs> they go one or two places, three places when they're leaving Jamaica. They're going to Canada, they're going to the United States, or they're going to England. Right. You understand what I'm saying? So what happens when they reach them spots? The twang gets mixed up, the slangs get introduced, mm. and people start using the slangs. That's why... The UK people sound like they have their Jamaican accent with the UK twang, and Canadians have the same Jamaican accent with our swang. Yeah. So that's why people are like, oh, it sounds like the UK thing. And then men are going out to the UK and they're bubbling and working with the UK, and their men are like, yo, it's a similar vibe. The men are the same. Like, woo. But he did chat some, some shits like, man, get me, get me, get me. But it's the track. It's the track, right? It's the track. It's called War. So okay. is he supposed to be talking about planting roses? Facts. Okay. Right. Like, well, here's the thing. Cream, whatever. Cream, I did the dramatic reading on the radio show. You know, like I'm taking sides. My goal is to make everyone feel like with the right songs and the right team and the right amount of drive and focus that they can push that they can push past the darkness and be able to provide for their people and create a legacy. All right. <laughs> <laughs> Now, this camera's getting a lot of joint shots, eh? Preem had his, his um, statement okay. that he, he posted on Instagram. So I'm going to read yeah. this out for y'all. All right? So he says, I personally told Drizzy a hundred times, and shout out to Toronto Rappers because this is where I'm getting the post from. I personally told Drizzy a hundred times that I understand you want to help all these young rappers from Toronto, but it's going to cause problems because we can't keep track of who's beefing with who. Out of the goodness of his heart, he still shouts out all kinds of rappers from the city and their squads to provide opportunity for upcoming artists from their from their neighborhoods. Whether he does um, whether he does personally or it's someone in OVO that helps out. I know this is a fact. If niggas think Drake knows the little politics they got, he doesn't. I don't even know half of the st- shit that's going on no more. All right. Um, and I think if his intentions is to cause beef 
And if you think his intentions is to cause beef and not uplift you guys, you're wrong. As the biggest artist in the city and the world should, he tried to put y'all, um, he tried to put on for y'all. That's it. The man could have took all his M's and dipped. But he didn't. And he gets no ratings for it. Shaking my head. That's why I rock with my day ones. Pray. Okay. Whatever. He's entitled to his opinion. Right? Mm. People are going to say you're right. Some people are going to say you're wrong. You know, like, he's entitled to feel how he wants to feel. And Drake's entitled to feel how he wants to feel. He yeah. feels like he needs to come out with this big, long paragraph to explain himself then that's what he had to do yeah. right he knows they know they're very they're very methodical over there they know what the fuck they're doing they don't yeah, play but around I think there lightly was a mishap there i think they're ve- they are very methodical this is true but there he put out a song and then a whole bunch of shit came back that he was not fucking doesn't want yeah. and now he's like now we got a fucking he, he didn't, tr- yeah, yeah, sure, he didn't anticipate like i said the name is the song is war mm. so I, that's what i think that's all I think. I just think people just took the title and went with where he's going and they said, okay, this is the vibe. All right, I'm going to do my version then. Yeah. But honestly, when you listen to it, even if it wasn't titled that, if you just listen to it just based on it, you can understand why somebody took offense to what happened there. Yeah. You get it, but it's like, it's, it's just in this song in particular that you weren't mentioned in this song. However, I if biggest- you backtrack, right? If you backtrack a little bit, I'm just wondering: mm. Do they get men? Do certain areas get mentioned in his tracks at all? I, listen, I don't even go deep dive in there. <laughs> you could say yes and no. Just I'm the, I'm the, just, the, the, you're talking to the, you're talking listen, to the you know Drake so expert crazy? at the He's table. Got the one you know track you know called so Western Road Flows, mm. right? It's Western Road. That's like the, that's Southside. You know what I'm saying? He's mentioned multiple hoods. In that's what I'm tracks. saying. Yeah. Like, but that's like, why I'm. Like, that's all I'm asking. You know what I mean? Honestly, guys, and I'm. I'm not trying to be disrespectful. I don't no. listen to a lot of Drake mm-hmm, like that, mm-hmm. so I don't know. And I'm just asking. <laughs> so sad wants no smoke. Yeah, like literally, I don't want any smoke. Zero. What's I'm, the girl's name? She could be persuasive. <laughs> uh, the girl that could be sus- pers- persuasive. Uh, uh, send Kayla. Uh, Kay- is she Kayla? Cause she's persuasive or whatever. That's what he says in the track, eh? <laughs> One of these girls, he said you can send a G. She's oh, very persuasive. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. In that little Bugs um, leak. Or the Bugs-ish type yeah, of leak. But Sam no, no smoke. Mm-hmm. I don't know what you guys She's, are talking she about. She has a smoke-free <laughs> diet. You know what I'm saying? Well, she, yeah. has, she, has, she has a smoke-free diet. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good one. You Gucci. should put that on a shirt. Smoke-free diet. You're just sitting in the cut there. I, I feel like you have a feeling the man's about grinning. this. man's grinning. I just see him grinning. I hear him. Forward to, the mic. <laughs> Forward to the mic over here. I want to hear what you got to say about this. Yes, what's your, what's your take, Gucci? Yeah, what's your take on this tune here? On the war? Yeah, yeah. yeah. On everything. The yeah, war, the, war. the remixes. The statements that are being released. Did you see, you, you see Drake's statement? Yeah, I seen his statement. But Make sure that, that I heard. I feel like I heard a beep. <laughs> yeah, I seen a statement, but I don't like... I don't look at it like it's something big, like I, right. You know? I don't. I don't get it. Like there's no. I don't. I don't know why there's an issue with that. Yeah. I, yeah. I, don't, I, don't I think. They, I think they, like a beef thing. I think they made it more of an issue by him making a statement. Like he shouldn't have said nothing. He should have just like, I what he must have felt he needed to make a statement. Yeah. 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 Mm, bring the mic back down, Seth. Nope. I didn't see that. <laughs> <laughs> don't me right I can turn now. it up and post. I'm sure you got that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Really for the filter I just rolled up. Oops, I'm sorry, like, what were you saying? But maybe. I was like, maybe somebody checked him on that. Like, I don't know. Mm. I don't know. Like, I'm just saying because you mentioned so many different things, so many kind of different areas, if you want to put it that way. Okay. But then I'm like, then you have... I'm gonna have to go listen to this song again because I, I didn't know there was that much politics in the yeah, song yeah. going on. I think that's what it is. I think you guys didn't really listen to the song. I think it's because listen to me. I didn't know I like, like, politics. the shit out of that. I think it's because I, I was like paused and it was like, did you hear that? Let's go back. Mm-hmm. Well, did you hear that? And I was like, oh. You know what? Here's a good idea. And then I caught another one. And we could t- t- wrap this up in a nice tight bow. Mm-hmm. How about Drizzy Drake? And turn your mic up so we can get your opinion nice and clear. Same time. How about Drizzy Drake come on the podcast and explain it to us directly? 
That would be impressive. That would be amazing. That would be good. Yeah, Gucci's clapping for that. Hey, gang, gang. Hey, hey. Gucci's clapping for that. Ricky Ideas. I know we, I know we'll have a nice location for that. You know what I'm saying? Definitely. Yeah, we could play <laughs> on the street. You know what I'm saying? Definitely. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We could do that. Soft. You know what I'm saying? Don't worry. We'll get a, we'll, we'll get a way better interview than Elliot and B-Dot. Let's go. Drizzy Drake, 2020. <laughs> All right, let's cut to a break, man. I'm done. <laughs> right, is like, let me cut to a break real quick before I put my foot further in my mouth. Yeah. Um, big up to Mo Spence. Got a nice track here. Track is called Butterflies. Sing. 